are heartrendingly beautiful. And really, it's extraordinary to me for two reasons. One is that he had the inspiration to write them. And secondly, that he still had such freshness and um, powers of musical communication as such an old man. I mean, he really did not wane in his ability to weave that kind of magic. And that, to me, is very touching as well. But the overview of that, the sum total of those experiences, is uh, incredibly affecting and beautifully wrought. Of course, you need a great singer to sing it. And I don't think anybody would dispute that Christine Brewer basically owns this music. It's a silly thing to say because nobody owns anything in music, but she inhabits this music so gloriously and so completely. I've done this piece with her in other places and it is, it is magical what she is able to do. Um, she just understands the right balance and the right amount of pathos in the music without getting um, indulgently overdramatic and she allows the music to flourish in exactly the way I think it should. It is unique to hear her sing this music and I, I cannot wait to bring it for the first time in Hellsberg Hall um, to life with her. It's just, it's great. And I can't wait to play it.